<laughs> so today we are going to talk about how to get a uh, sprout from rice grain. The steps are so easy and simple. Actually, today I'm so so excited because I was successful in getting this sprout. As we know in poultry farming, the major problem that we have is that the feed, the cost of feed. Because there are some times when the prices of this feed go so high, they shoot so high in that a farmer is not even able to, to break through. So we have to find all the means in order to be able to feed our birds and feeding them at a low cost. And then we'll be able to all benefit from this poultry farming. So these sprouts are so good. Before we look at the benefits on how to get these sprouts from the rice grain, let me first tell you the benefits of these sprouts. Number one, these sprouts contain chlorophyll. This chlorophyll helps to give our bird the yellow yolk. And as we know, the eggs which are having yellow yolk, they have high demand compared to these other birds which do not have uh, the yellow yolk. There are other eggs which are having the white yolk, some yolk is black. So please make sure that you sprout your grain, you sprout the rice in order to get the yellow yolk eggs. Here you will be able to sell your product so easily and get the money. Then another benefit, if you sprout uh, the grain, here in this case we are sprouting rice, uh, your, these sprouts are containing a lot of minerals. For example, they contain protein, they contain vitamins, the amino acids are there. So you can see that instead of looking for uh, all those other sources of these product of these minerals, for example, protein, some people look for fish in order to get the protein. You are going to get all these minerals in one thing in these sprouts. So please make sure that. You try to get these sprouts in order to feed your bird, and it is so cheap, it is cost friendly, it's very cheap compared to when you're buying the other feed. And then another benefit, these sprouts have an enzyme content, and when we talk about an enzyme content, we know that an enzyme is a catalyst, so meaning that they are highly digested. So birds which feed uh, on these sprouts, that feed is 50% more digestible compared to, to the, the birds which feed on the grain which are not sprouted. When they are highly digested, it means that you're going to get the required weight. For example, in broilers, we know that the weight is so important because that is what is required on the market. And then also in birds, uh, when you're growing birds, before they give you eggs, they have to first reach the required weight in order for them to start laying. So if you're feeding your birds on these sprouts, uh, they are going to give you eggs so easily, so early. Uh, when the time reaches, they will not lay. And we know when the birds lay, it costs us financially because you have to continue feeding them before you start earning from them. But before we go to the steps, uh, if you are new on this channel, my name is Lillian and I'm from Kevara Farm. Please consider subscribing to this channel. On this channel, we talk about everything poultry. Let it be broilers, broilers, uh, layers, everything. So be sure that you're going to get all the knowledge about poultry farming. And to our returning viewers, I'm really grateful. Thank you for watching me. Thank you for always coming to watch my videos. I can't take that for granted. The steps of sprouting this rice is so easy. Uh, what you have, you have to get your rice and then put it in a container, a clean container, and then soak it in water for 12 hours, and that is one day. And then the following day, you rinse, uh, you remove the rice from that water.
and then you soak it in another water for five minutes. Then the following day, you remove that from the water and then you put it in a, you put it in a sack. I'm so excited. This is so good. Uh, you can see. This is so good and the birds like it. So you can see. They are sprouted so well. So you can see. So just have a look at this. So you can just have a look at this. This is so good. Actually, these are the roots. The roots came up so well. And if we wanted, we would continue and then get the fodder from this. So you can see this is so good. So I'm going to, I'm going to go and give the birds and i'm sure the birds love it i've never give it given it to the birds i'm trying it for the first time so let's put in a container and see how the birds are going to react much for watching me. If you are new on this channel, my name is Lillian and I'm from Kevara Farm. Please consider subscribing to this channel. It's a wonderful channel and be sure that you're going to learn a lot about poultry farming. And to our returning viewers, I'm really so grateful. Thank you so much. I can't take you for granted. So thank you so much for watching this video. Bye-bye. Till the next video.